Hey guys, my boo hi and welcome to Jay's Nest. I want to talk about this petite crown diaper. I've had this diaper in my stash for two years now. This is their all-in-one diaper. Can I find the inserts to this? Probably not. Somewhere lost in this basket. It's a natural fiber all-in-one. It has a snap in the front and in the back to make it like flap style. But I wanna show you how this diaper has worn over the past two years. I haven't reached for it much over the past year just because of how it's wearing and I don't want it to like completely disintegrate. But I just wanna show you how natural fiber things can wear over time. So natural fiber all-in-ones, natural fiber pockets, they don't last forever. The thing about natural fibers is they break down over time. That's just the nature of textiles in general. But I think it's helpful to show you how diapers have worn and what they look like after a year of use or a few years of use. Let me <laughs> let me show you how holy it is. This is my holy diaper. So up by this front panel, there are holes right here. And then on this other side, there is a hole right there. A lot of times diapers do get edge wear. So if you have like a Thirsty's natural all-in-one, a Smart Bottoms all-in-one, you'll start to see edge wear on the elastics. It is exactly what it sounds like. The edge of the diaper starts to wear down. So as you can see here, there's a little bit of edge wear there. A little bit of edge wear here. On the other elastic, there's a lot of edge wear here. I have not looked at the PUL of this diaper, so I'm actually gonna turn it out and we're gonna see how it's worn over two years. All right, let's see the damage. One way that you can check the PUL or TPU of your diapers is to hold each side and gently pull. Don't pull really hard, but give it a gentle tug and that will show you if there are any small rips, tears, or holes. No, this looks good. I don't see anything wrong with the PUL of the diaper. Actually, I think it might be TPU to be honest. I don't remember. So yeah, that is the nature of natural fibers is they do wear over time, which is a bummer. One of my favorite products from Petite Crown is their swim cover. I actually use it as a pocket diaper because it has a pocket opening in the back. You can use it as a pocket diaper or you can use it as a swim cover and I love that. I just really enjoy how athletic wicking jersey wears over time. So this is actually my favorite product. I know I've reviewed their covers. And I think I reviewed this all in one. There are a lot of factors of why diapers can get a lot of edge wear over time. And here are a few factors. The way that you wash it. So the agitation that happens in the wash can absolutely affect it. Agitation refers to how the diaper rubs up against different things. How many diapers you have in your wash <laughs> determines the agitation that you have. The temperature that you wash them on, if you wash them on hot water and dry them on high heat, your diapers will wear down a little faster. When I first started cloth diapering, I actually had people tell me that they you know, dried their diapers on high heat for like six months and their diapers were fine. Well, I started doing that for myself and I realized my diapers were starting to wear down a lot faster. And so the temperature that you wash and dry your diapers at really does matter in the long term. You're not gonna see something happen one, you know, you dry your diapers on high heat one time, you're not gonna see anything happen. And if you're wanting your diapers to last a really, really long time, that is definitely something to consider. The amount of diapers you have in your stash also matters. So if you have more diapers in your stash, you're gonna have less wear on them because you're rotating them, right? If you have six diapers in your stash and you're washing every single day, well, your diapers are gonna have a lot of wear just after a year's time. I think there is value in seeing how diapers wear. You know, especially if you're looking to buy products and you're looking to purchase products and you want to know how they wear over time. This is not abnormal and I want to state that and I want to make that clear. This is not abnormal for a natural fiber product. If you go to swap pages, Smart Bottoms is like the perfect example. So is Thirsty's. Thirsty's all-in-ones, for some reason they tear up really, really fast compared to other brands. That's not true for everybody. There are some people who have had Thirsty's all-in-ones for two years and they look fine. Um, but that is like a common like baseline thing with Thirsty's natural all-in-ones is they do tend to wear down a little faster than other all-in-ones. Smart Bottoms is another great example. If you go to the Smart Bottoms swap page, you'll see <laughs> that, you know, the diapers get wear, they get edge wear, they get holes after time. And that's just part of natural fiber inners like this. That's really why I prefer pocket diapers with like athletic wicking jersey because I'm not gonna get holes in this like I do with this. I started to get holes before the year mark of using it and I didn't really use this much last year because of all the holes and I didn't want to just like rip apart. And you know, while we're talking about natural fibers, they do get holes after time. So I have these Geffen hemp inserts. Oh man, I have a Geffen hemp flat. That's so bad. This one isn't as bad. I'm sure people are wondering why it's even in my stash. I'm gonna find this flat. Give me one second. Probably a few minutes, but it's video editing magic. <laughs> this thing, okay. Sis. 
let that shit go, right? You were probably looking at me like, it's like, this is like the equivalent to like male boxers with holes in it. Just let it go, sis. Let it go. Okay, it's Dundee. But, you know, <laughs> you know, um, I'm holding on, okay? It's still got life. You see this right here? That's life, okay? That's absorbency. It's, it's still got life, okay? And again, that doesn't make the product inherently bad. It's just the nature of natural fibers. They wear down over time and they don't last forever. Yeah, they just, they, they really don't last forever, which is sad because I've, I've used, man, I got this flat used for like five bucks, I think, on the swap page. And I've used it consistently for the past three years, okay? It, it's lasted a long time, totally worth the money. Thank you so much for watching. Tell me down, if you made it this far, tell me down below what diaper has worn down the fastest for you? What brand? Um, and what type of diaper? Was it an all-in-one? <laughs> was it a flat? <laughs> this is probably the worst looking diaper I had. I'm going strong. I will use this until it's gone, okay? I will use it until it's gone. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.